we're going to the northeast region and coming up next is Wuni. Anula Ghana, Anula Northeast. I want to say a very big thank you to the regional house of chiefs of the northeast region. Haji Ahumu, Honorable Rashida Napaam, Team Wuni, students and lecturers of Tamale Technical University, members of CCC Worldwide, and Pastor Eric Boache Yadom. God bless each and every one of you for standing by me. Tonight is all about entrepreneurship, and I'm here to give you a business idea that women can venture into. To keep me in the competition, kindly dial star 713 star 13 hash, or you can download the TV3 app on Apple App Store or on the Google Play Store. Thank you very much. I'm Pussy Apam. As a young lady, I've always dreamt of becoming the richest woman in Africa. So I decided to start my own business. And I realized that most of the ladies out there these days, they want to sell clothes, bags, shoes, and beauty products. So I wanted to change the narrative. Then I remembered that most of my friends in down south always call me, Wuni, I want you to buy me peanut butter. And knowing that my region is one of the largest producers of granite and it's in high demand globally, I decided to start Wuni's Peanut Butter and Bread Spread. With Wuni's Peanut Butter, our mission is to encourage healthy eating of peanut butter and also address issues that has to do with male infertility. We aim, we aim, we aim to empower and marginalized individuals by giving them employment. I mean, who is an entrepreneur without touching lives? Our mission, our vision is to make sure that we produce quality and delicious peanut butter for all age groups in Ghana and beyond. With a capital of 500 Ghana cities, you can start your own business. And in a space of one month, you will make double of the amount. You know the cool job? Oh, you know the cool job? Thank you very much. In a day, you process granules into peanut butter. The only thing you have to do is to fry your granules, dry it, grind it, and package it nicely. Then, after that, you make sure that you make use of social media, of course, to reach out to a wider audience. My people, in the next two years, I want to see Wuni's peanut butter everywhere in Ghana. In fact, to also cross the borders with Wuni's peanut butter, we say that Eat Ghana, grow Ghana, antigenic, antibody, anti comfort. Please, I have samples of Wuni's peanut butter for you to try at home. Try it and give me your response. With Wuni's peanut butter, we say that together we can come together and make Ghana a better place, especially women. Thank you very much. Wuni from the Northeast region presenting the Wuni's peanut butter. I would love to try that. Let me find out from Comfort if she would love to try it as well. Definitely, I would like to try it. But there was one thing that I was expecting from her presentation. And Winnie, because this goes directly inside us, we want to be sure of product quality. I didn't hear how you would um, ensure that what we get there would be very good uh, product. Additionally, I had male fertility, infertility, and it piqued my attention. And I was like, hmm, but you didn't tell us how that marries with this one. So if it is a selling point, it is a unique selling point, and therefore you must drill that part down as well. Thank but well done much. to your product. Um, you, you must much. look at how you standardize it, because I can see some are dark, some are lighter, so there's a, there's a lot that you need to do to help your product be nationwide as your vision is. I like the fact that you gave us your vision. I like the fact that you gave us your mission. So far, you are the first person to mention that. And any, every business should be able to tell us what the mission is and what the vision is. Well done. Thank you. Thank you so much, Comfort. And to Jibodi, what are your thoughts? Um, yeah, so Uni, I'm actually interested in knowing how the connection between 
male infertility and the peanut butter. Okay, Auntie. So I conducted a little research, and in what I found, it says that if a man takes in peanut butter or peanuts, it reduces the, uh, the risk of him uh, being impotent. <laughs> Okay. Um, okay. Um, when it, <laughs> I think this will be another discussion for another time, since we don't have, since we don't have time. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I mean, when you when you are going to um, actually just advice for you as an entrepreneur, before you actually use research to sell your product, you have to base it on some certain facts, and then you know certain details because research based selling is a totally different thing because you may say it and it will affect your brand completely because this could just be somebody's idea especially when you just found it on the internet so um, that's my first thing i think one of the things is the consistency i looked at the packaging and from where you're coming from and what you are trying to do the packaging you have you said that young ladies focus on clothes and things which are all from outside and they're important so you are doing something authentic show it like you could have done like a calabash or something to basically show what you represent thank you for your presentation thank you auntie Winnie presenting her Winnie's peanut butter a round of applause for Winnie. and of course she has her research but you as well can keep her in the competition by voting for her the short code is star 713 star 13 hash across all networks Bang away, go.